What's up everybody? So I know you have to be having the question about how to get that new HubSpot chat widget on your website. It's in your HubSpot portal. You may not know exactly what to do in order to customize it. And today I'm going to show you how. Are you a HubSpot user looking for fun and interactive education that helps you be better at HubSpot? Then welcome to Sprocket Talk. So, you know, as we dig into HubSpot and all the different settings that are available, the one thing that is for sure is that settings is becoming a behemoth. I'm going to show you today how to just jump in and modify your chat widget settings so you can make them on brand and also stand out the right way. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to jump in to your settings tab up here with the gear in the top. With that gear, you're going to then go to conversations right here and you're going to go to chat appearance. So you'll notice a couple things. You've got the HubSpot branding option to turn on or off and then you have your accent color. HubSpot has some interesting chat colors that are accent colors out of the box. A lot of times this gradient orange one is available and you'll notice that you've got the preview option for the launcher, which is just the, the button that would be in the bottom right, along with the chat bubble. And then of course, opening it up to see what the entire chat bubble looks like. The thing that you have to pay attention to is that you want this to be on brand, but it has to stand out. So for instance, if we're using orange on our website throughout the entire site, you're going to want some other accent color that would make it stand out because that little chat bubble right here is all people are gonna see if there isn't a message that is being triggered like you see here in this preview. A lot of times what I recommend is to give a contrasting color or a lot of times brands have a secondary color that you can use. Go ahead and use that secondary color, make that chat bubble stand out a little bit and you'll see some higher engagement rates. So that's it for setting up the chat appearance for your HubSpot chat widget. I'm Remington Begg from Impulse Creative. If you have any other questions, please hit us up. And until next time, happy HubSpotting.